It was their first kiss as king and queen, and the crowd seemed to love it. Philippe and Mathilde, Belgium's seventh royal couple with their four children in tow, greeted the public. People waited for hours outside the palace to catch the first glimpse of the old and new monarchs. 53-year-old Philippe took over from his father, Albert, who announced his abdication less than three weeks ago. Albert will be keeping his title, just like his sister-in-law, Queen Fabiola, did before him. I swear I will respect the constitution and the law of the Belgian people, maintain the independence of the country and keep the Belgian territory intact. Philippe took the oath in each of Belgium's three official languages. It was a political signal. The country is split between Dutch-speaking Flanders and French-speaking Wallonia. And it was unity Albert called for in his final speech as king. Work ceaselessly for a united Belgium. You will then be able to be the builders of peace. Then our country will remain an inspiration to Europe, which searches for unity through diversity. And his subjects expect exactly that, a monarch who will serve as a unifying figurehead. I hope Philip will bring the Flemish and Wallonian people together. Most people think there's a deep divide between us right now. He plays a symbolic role rather than a political one. For that very reason, he's so influential. The new royal couple enjoys immense popularity, a rare symbol of Belgian unity.